Hello, it's Vicky with Condi Systems Technical Support here today to talk about the new X6 Corel Draw features. And one of the features that I'm going to include in a video is the Object Properties Docker. And it's a new feature in X6, it doesn't come with the earlier versions, but I get asked a lot what's new in X6 and what is the, uh, what would be. Uh, included in the purchase and would it be worth the purchase? Well, there's a lot of new features in X6 and one of the new features that I've run across um, and am uh, getting up to speed with is the Object Properties Docker and it's a very handy feature where you can click on an object within your graphic and uh, manipulate it, tweak it, change the color, do a lot of fancy work uh, without having to go to individual tools or task bars to uh, to get the uh, to accomplish the job, so I'm going to show you where that's at. I've created from my left tools here a polygon, um, drawn it on the page, just to show you some basics. A lot of my videos are just basic information about how to work the tools and information about. Um, things you can do with the tools, how to find the tools, those kind of things, simple questions that I get asked here at Condi from uh, our department or within our department. So I like to take those questions and create something that I think is useful for our clients and uh, get them started so that you guys can uh, get out there and practice and utilize some of these things. Uh, save you a little time I hope and give you some quick basics to get you started. So. I have drawn this over here on the page and I'm going to go up with this polygon on the page and if you don't know how to do that just click on the polygon and just draw something create a color by left clicking on the color and right click to create a stroke of the same color or a different color right click you can change the stroke color by right clicking okay and that's how you do it I'm going to delete that one now what I want to do is go find my uh, properties um, my object, my properties object docker. So I want to find that and place it over here so that I can make changes to this uh, particular shape. Okay, so I'm going to go up here and left click on Windows. I'm going to come down to Dockers and it's right here at the top. Also, if you look to the right, it shows a um, hotkey for how to get the properties docker to appear on your screen as well. And that's by clicking Alt Enter. Okay and that's on your keyboard. So I'm just going to left click on object properties and there's my object properties docker. So in here I have a lot of things I can do uh, from within this. I'm going to click my pick tool and select this so that I get a drop down of everything that I can manipulate within this docker to my uh, cut shape over here. And so what that gives you, and you can see, you have to select the object to see what options you have that you can manipulate. As you can see, there's a lot of things that's been added here that is quick access for, um, for changing and tweaking color, shape, uh, corners, nodes, all kinds of things from within this docker you can do very convenient. So if I wanted to change the width I could do that here, or the points. I can change the color as well just by quickly uh, clicking on a color or I can come down here and choose my value number uh, which those values are um, can be generated by RGB, CMYK, all of your color charts within here. We like to use RGB here at Condi. So as you can see I have a red one now. I can use this eyedropper to go and get a color as you can see okay the eyedropper will let me pick something or I can just type it in if I want I can just type in the color or I can do uh, fancy things um, um, to this object like creating grids things like that from within the graphic so all kinds of fancy things you can do here with this if you scroll down, you can even change the number of sides. You can increase the number of sides. I think that's real fancy uh, for um, changing the shape in any way that uh, you need to. You have these nodes 
that you can drag using some of the other new features that I've shown you with the smear tool, um, the attract, repel, and the uh, twirl tool, which is in some of my earlier videos. So again, this is the Object Properties Docker. Very handy tool. Make sure you pay attention to all the uh, things you can utilize from within here. These are your corners. You can change your corners, things like that. Um, make sure you take advantage of what's new in Corel X6. Look to my other videos that are coming up for all the new features in Corel X6. And again, I thank you for your time. This is Vicki with Condi Systems.